everyone today we are going to see a, a flow chart of a bisection method so starting with the start after that we are going to take an input value that is read x1 x2 acc and f of x as a given data you can say then we are going to initialize i equal to 0 i represent the iterations moving forward we are going to have we will going to print the iteration number x1 x2 z and f of z as a heading of a tabular column after that we are going to use a while loop in which a modulus of x1 minus x2 if it is greater than accuracy then we should move inside and find out the value of z z equal to x1 plus x2 divided by 2 further we are going to print those value inside the table with the sequence i x1 x2 z and f of z after printing the value we have a condition f of x1 into f of z if it is lesser than 0 then x2 equal to z if it is not less than 0 if it is not less than 0 then x1 equal to z so if an else condition here we are going to use if it satisfies the condition then x2 equal to z and if it doesn't satisfy the condition then x1 equal to z at the end of if uh, condition statement we are going to have i equal to i plus 1 and we are going to connect we have to end the while loop by the then after end of while loop we are going to proceed further for printing our answer so we are going to print the answer as print the values i and z so we are going to finally print the answer let's see again the flowchart and then we are going to end let's see again how the flowchart works so we will begin with a start then we are going to have uh, input value x1 x2 accuracy f of x then we are going to have initializing the statement i equal to 0 then we are going to print the iteration number x1 x2 z and f of z in a tabular form let me show how we are going to print it so for printing iteration number x1 x2 z and f of z i will give a demo on a microsoft office we are going to consider a table in which first column will be of iteration number first column will be of iteration itr number in short form second column will be of x1 third column will be of x2 fourth column will be of z and fifth column will be of f of z let me increase the size so that it would be visible, uh, visible for all so this is how we are going to print the table heading iteration number x1 x2 z and f of z so this is the print stand for the heading of a, ta a tabular column then we are going to use a logic of a while loop looping statement where x1 x2 is greater than accuracy then we are going to find the value of z that is x1 plus x2 divided by 2 and then we are going to print those value i x1 x2 z f of z in that table for substituting for getting to the next iteration we are going to use a condition if, if and else condition if it satisfy f of x1 into f of z is less than 0 then it will replace x2 equal to z else if it doesn't satisfy it will give x1 equal to z after the end of if loop we are going to have addition to the counter i equal to i plus 1 so that it could proceed to the next step after ending the if loop we are going after the i equal to i plus 1 statement we are going to end the while loop so we need to connect an arrow back to the while from i equal to i plus 1 and so while loop is having this loop if it doesn't satisfy the equation 
that is uh, x1 minus x2 is greater than accuracy if it is less than accuracy then it should go outside and it should finally print the answer and that is the end of the flowchart thank you for watching this video